So hello and welcome to my YouTube channel. Uh, my name is Cecilia, I'm an illustrator and this video is for reviewing uh, a product that it's called Deleter Black Ink 4. So um, I bought this ink because I was looking for a dark permanent waterproof ink uh, that I can use in my illustrations. I love to use black for the outlines. Uh, and also I wanted um, to do some galaxy effect on my illustrations but I wanted it to be waterproof so that later I can put other colors like purple and blue in, in the background and it doesn't um, merge or blend with the black uh, ink and this one I guess um, it was perfect because it, I was, I'm going to use it with salt to create those galaxy texture effect and yeah let's see how it turns out stay with me and let's see what this bad boy can do <laughs> so i'm not going to leave any link for you to buy this product because this is not <laughs> no one paid me to do this and also um i'm from portugal so in every country is different the price and where you get them from I bought mine from eBay you may bought them may buy them from Amazon they're cheaper uh, so it's up to each of you uh, if you want to buy these products or not uh, to search a little and see where you can get it cheaper so I made this little uh, swatch with uh, the black uh, the deleter black in you know water uh, watercolor paper to see how it reacts. Um, that little blob, it's the salt one. And then I'm going to test it out with some colors and some uh, white ink to see if it's waterproof and if it blends or if it. I'm going to test out. <laughs> <laughs> so I don't have any surprises when I'm painting my illustrations it's nice to test out the products so yeah, just making a little galaxy effect there with some purple and some blue As you can see, no, none of the colors uh, bleed to each other. Now I'm just going to use this white liter to see how it works on top of this black. Make some galaxy stars. <laughs> I put it there on my palette and just sprinkle it up <laughs> to see how it looks and if it doesn't uh, bleed with the black. So yeah, I guess it's dried so you can use it nicely. So here I have my um, sketch out a uh, galaxy girl <laughs> in uh, watercolor paper and I'm just going to make the lines the line art with the micron pen it's also waterproof micron my, my, <laughs> micron pen uh, this is also a waterproof pen uh, I really like waterproof stuff I guess <laughs> Uh, so yeah, just made the, the outlines so we can then go in mess it up with the black ink <laughs> and salt so this is the the deleter black 4 manga ink uh, waterproof, extra dark uh, it's mainly used for dip pens which you can use with a pencil uh, they say not to use with a fountain pen <laughs> uh, 
Um, so yeah, I'm going to test it out to see if it it's good or not, and if it really is waterproof. <laughs> um, so yeah, when it dries, it's waterproof and has a slightly darker hue. Uh, it doesn't contain any acrylic ink. So yeah, that's good. They say also that it's uh, archival quality, light fast, whatever that means. <laughs> uh, so yeah, stay with me and I will test out this lovely uh, black ink. So yeah, just open it up. And ta-da! We have a, <laughs> a little lid inside. Hope I don't get my fingers dirty. This is the salt that I'm going to use. It's really fine salt. I'll just zoom out a little bit for you to see. So now I'm just wetting um, where I want the black ink. I'm going to wet all of the part of the hair because I want her to have like a galaxy hair. Um, so I wet it out. Wet. I wet all that uh, space of the hair to create um, a blending effect, I guess. I hope I don't get any in the face. <laughs> so I hope I'm not boring with this video, but I, I thought it was better to leave it uh, live and not a speed video for you to see the in real time the effect. So after wetting all the area, I'm going to dip my brush into the black ink directly and just make like little spots, as you can see, little spots of ink for it to merge in the paper and the water to create this like tie dye effect. and get all of that area black so painting really really carefully there in the outer body Just trying to get all of that area black so that I can apply the salt and see what happens. You be careful there in the, <laughs> the face. <laughs> this is me telling myself. I'm sorry.
some more black there. I'm sorry if I'm boring you. So after getting all of those black, I get my salt and I just sprinkle it like little glitter <laughs> on top of the black ink. It should be uh, wet, otherwise it won't work. So it has to be a fast process because we want it to be wet and not dry, otherwise the salt won't work. Uh, the salt here just uh, works as a, a sponge and sucks up the the ink, I guess, and leaves this little this I don't know this effect in the the paper, like little white spots. It's really nice. You will see. So after the black ink dries uh, and we take out the, the salt, it leaves this texture uh, in our illustration, kind of, I don't know, it absorbs the, the black and leaves some white spots. It, it, really, it really is a cool uh, effect. Uh, and now I'm just uh, painting her dress with the same black ink with a pencil with a pencil, <laughs> with a brush, <laughs> sorry. So after all the, the black ink is dry, I'm just going to uh, paint with uh, the blue and purple in the white spots so it creates this uh, galaxy effect. Uh, I'm using a, a water brush from Pento if you're wondering um, so yeah I just paint all of those um, white spots uh, with black, ah, with, black <laughs> with purple and blue <laughs> hearing some construction noise in the background there's a, a construction here in my house, near my house, not in my house. I'm sorry. Uh, okay, never mind. So, um, as you can see, uh, the the black doesn't blend with the the blue or purple. It is uh, waterproof. Yay! <laughs> uh, so yeah. So here she is, all painted. Uh, I didn't show the process of the face because it's not the purpose of this video. It's only the black. Um, and I'm going to use this deleter white, uh, also waterproof, uh, to make the highlights of the, the face and the hair and sprinkle it with some white spots to create the, the stars of our galaxy hair. Uh, so now into the second fun part that is uh, making this a starry night <laughs> as you can see I put a paper on her face so it doesn't get messed up with uh, all those dots uh, you just tap your pencil with the, the in your finger and you, it will create this starry effect also I will be using some dotting tools to make those dots of uh, stars to make some constellations in her galaxy hair so I love this part doing the galaxy also I may I put some uh, shooting stars um, I love making the stars part it's so satisfying and relaxing you should try it <laughs> uh, it's really fun and relaxing uh, also, with a, uh, a brush, I'm just putting some highlights uh, in her eyes, in her face, in her dress, and all of those details. And yeah, and 
I will also be putting some um, highlights on her hair with white, as you can see. Um, so it creates that, that effect that it is her hair. <laughs> so yeah, that's it. So yeah, this is it. <laughs> Here she is, my galaxy girl. So thank you so much for watching uh, this video. If you like this kind of uh, RT stuff, uh, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel. And if you have any questions, please leave a comment down below and I will get to you as soon as I can. So thank you so much and I will see you in the next one. Bye!